of the overlay menu on banking what we have. Uh, M banking is the name of the application we've given, can be customized to what you want. I enter the login pin and it opens up the menu available from the overlay. Let's go into banking, basic banking services of inquiry, fund transfer, UPI payments, cash withdrawal, and last five transactions. Let's do a fund transfer here from these two bank accounts, we can save up to five bank accounts in the overlay directly. I'm choosing a account uh, to a bank account or a credit card or a UPI account. Let me do it to a bank account. I can have up to, again, uh, 20 beneficiaries available over here. I'm choosing only one, which is Roy. Amount I'm saying is 500 rupees. And I say, OK. It shows me the preview, what I want to transfer, to account number so and so. I say OK. It asks me for my net banking pin, which I can put a dummy pin right now. And then SMS goes out to the overlay uh, uh, server. Let's come into wallets. Wallets can be of two kinds, a merchant wallet and a customer wallet. A merchant wallet is assisted services where he can do check balance for a walk-in customer. He can top up his wallet or top up his account. Uh, let me top up his wallet, a customer account. From the merchant, I can use his wallet, his bank account, or his UPI account. Let me use his bank account for topping up. Again, I have those two accounts available. Let me use C as a nickname for the account. He wants to select two. A transit wallet. Yeah. Wallet ID is... I'm just putting a dummy number right now here. Amount it says is 500. So what actually happens over here is I'm debiting the merchant bank account over here to and creating the same amount to a customer wallet ID under HDFC wallet amount account of four rupees 500. And I say net banking pin because I actually debited the customer the merchant bank account. And then SMS now goes out. Uh, let me come into the customer wallet for you where I can do oh, let me do a cash out for you over here cash out can be using his wallet his bank account or a UPI account uh, let me use his bank account as a cash out I want to debit his account with the name of C uh, this is the merchant ID which I need to enter because the money has to go into the merchant account this is the merchant ID amount is here again 500 rupees here uh, so cashing out the debit account is given over here the merchant ID is given over there amount is given over there and this is the net banking pin I enter over here now an SMS goes out let me show you on say bill payments I take for example electricity bill I want to pay I want to pay a Tata Power Bill uh, account CA account could be I put any dummy account I want over here uh, pay from again account credit card or a wallet let me use account I'll show be I'll be showing those two accounts here amount is say 250 rupees it'll show me my preview over here Tata Power Bill paid by account number so and so amount so and so okay net banking pin I just put one dummy pin right now here and the SMS goes out I want to do uh, the same thing as on bill payments I have electricity telephone these are the postpaid accounts charity credit cards I can do what I want over here uh, let me come into other payments other payments are I want to pay to a merchant pay from my bank account I have those two accounts available here to a merchant account, card, UPI or a wallet. Let me pay a merchant wallet account. Which wallet does he have? Here. And I put the wallet ID over here. Amount I want to pay him is 200 rupees. Here. Pay from to a merchant bank account, HDFC, 200 rupees. Okay, net banking pin. I enter a dummy pin right now, and the SMS goes out. 
Uh, I can also pay an individual again from my bank account, my card, or a UPI account or a wallet account. Let me say a card. I have saved in a card as my card nickname is Blue. Two, I want to pay a merchant into his wallet account using what? Transit which wallet? Maybe I say I say wallet. Wallet ID of the merchant is given over here. Amount is say, 200 here. Pay from the card number so and so, expiry so and so, individual wallet ID so and so. I put the account and I put the CVV of the card and it goes through. Now, this is the basic menu over here available. Let me show you something on settings. Uh, my bank accounts, I have edit over here. I can edit this. Account name is so and so. Nickname, I can change this out to be as uh, a access. Okay, I say okay. Account number, IFFC code here, and I enter my transaction pin. I have to enter the pin to save it, otherwise it will not be saved. So same way I can do up into bank accounts, I can do cards, I can do UPIs, wallets, billers, payees, my merchants. I can also do create pin and set up and change pin. Now when I issue an overlay, I issue it, I can have a default wallet created, I can have a default bank account created my UPI pin and my Aadhaar pin. I can have my wallet pin created over here for those three wallets available. I can do a banking pin for those two accounts created over here. So this basically is the overlay menu available to you from the bank from the phone.